after the total scope is defined in the scope statement, the next step is to break the total scope into more manageable components using a hierarchical structure called as work breakdown structure. The work breakdown structure is a hierarchical decomposition of the total scope of work to be carried out by the project team to accomplish the project objectives and create the required deliverables. Each descending level of the WBS represents an increasingly detailed definition of the project work. Now to understand more about WBS, let's consider a sample project which is launching a new model of a car. It has a car can be decomposed into three components entertainment and guidance, engine, transmission and suspension, body. Now, engine, transmission and suspension can be further decomposed into gearbox, engine, suspension and gears, differentials. Engine can be further decomposed into engine, block, gear, box, computer. Now we keep on we, we keep on decomposing till we reach work package level. The lowest level of the work breakdown structure is called as work package. Now till what level we should decompose the overall scope? It all depends on how much management and control we have to exercise. For example, in the overall scope, let's assume that we have to outsource certain pieces. Right? Now, there are certain pieces like entertainment and guidance which I have not decomposed further. Why I have not decomposed further? Because I might be outsourcing it to a supplier and who will decompose it further? The supplier. Right? Now, it might be a work package for me, but for supplier it will be a project. Now, engine, transmission and suspension, I have decomposed and subdivided sub to multiple level, very, very granular level, right? Now, I want to do engine, transmission and suspension myself, right? So, I have decomposed it into micro level, right? I have decomposed it to a level where I can track the progress in terms of time and cost very well, right? Now, what is a work package? Work package is the lowest level in the work breakdown structure which can be estimated, right? In terms of time and cost very easily, right? You can have a def almost definitely estimate at work package level if it is decomposed properly. Now, if you see this whole diagram, engine, gearbox, computer, active suspension, driver shaft, wheels, hub, trees, all these are what? Work packages. Right? Now, if let's assume that you know after dividing the work packages or after dividing the work breakdown structure into work packages at micro level, we outsource the product. Right? Instead of having coarse grain uh, work package, let's assume that you know we, uh, we have a very fine grain work packages and we outsource it to different vendors. Will you have more control of the project or not? Right? And in general, in the example that we were talking about, where the project was outsourced from one side, uh, a phase was decomposed into multiple work packages, right? So imagine that you know in the overall hierarchy of the scope or work breakdown structure at this level, different work packages were transition option, right? Can you tell a program manager and manager is right in house? See, it's very very contextual. It's very contextual. Right, I understand.
See, for example, I'll tell you in one of my training, in one of my training, you know, um, I read us, I read a line in a customer supplier environment. In a customer supplier environment, customers project manager allocates work packages to suppliers, team manager. They said we all are senior project managers in our organization, and our customer also allocates us work packages. Now see, within the context of your own organization, you might be a senior project manager, you might be a general manager, but within the context of the whole customer supplier environment, you are a team manager. Are you getting my point or not? Right? So you have to see if you consider the overall context, it's slightly different. For example, if these work packages are outsourced, you know, there is a customer side project manager, he will perceive the supplier side work package owner as a team manager. However, with, see, a work package owner is also a project manager who is doing a small scope of work. If you try to understand this whole structure, what we are doing here? We are breaking a big statement of work into small statement of works, right? Now there is another concept which is very very important from um, the understanding standpoint, control account. Now as I told you the lowest level in a work breakdown structure is called as work package and work package is at a level where a project manager tracks the earned value, the time and cost of the project. Apart from this, there is a concept called as control account. Now let's it depicts how your project costing will be tracked in financial by financial accounting division. See, when you talk about financial accounting, every cost center is a cost head. Every cost center is a cost head. For example, one way is you have one cost head at project level only, and you track. Accounting should track the entire project as a cost center, right? However, if the project is big, it's better to have multiple control control accounts within the project. For example, there is no hard and fast rule, but you know, see, if in this project, which is launching a new model of a car, if I put a control account for this branch, which is entertainment and guidance one control account at engine transmission and suspension and another for body right so how many cost centers would be there one at project level and three at branches level four now if these four if these four uh, control accounts are tracked separately as a separate head by financial accounting will it not be more regular tracking you will come see you will come to know what expenses and the effectiveness of management if at every cost center level, right? So this is control account. Now, how do we define control account? The definition of control account is like this. It's an intersection between project organization structure and the work breakdown structure. It is an intersection between the project organization breakdown structure and the work breakdown structure. See, whatever I have said is same because the lower levels will be led by what? Team leads, team lead 1, team lead 2, team lead 3. At every team lead level, we can have a control account. Right? Within control account, what do we have? Multiple work packages. Right? But you know, you should be very, very clear about the fact that one control account can have multiple work packages, but one work package cannot belong to multiple control account. Right? Now, apart from this, there is a con concept called as planning package. Now, what is a planning package? Now, within control account, uh, there can be some, some deliverables or some, uh, some components which about which you, know, you are still uh, not clear in terms of activity level decomposition. You are not clear what should be inside those. You, at a very high level, you should you, are, you know that okay. This component should will be included, but how it will be delivered, right? 
you have not you are not in a position to subdivide it further right you have a very high level knowledge about the requirements corresponding to those packages they are called as these components are called as planning packages yes later as you proceed ahead the projects are progressively leveled once you have clear idea about those components you will subdivide them further eventually you will get you know fine grain work packages out of the planning packages now if you see this work breakdown structure what is this a hierarchical decomposition of the scope now in this decomposition right i do not have any description right now the description of all the work packages of work breakdown structure is there in work breakdown structure dictionary right and as we discussed three things three things together comprises the scope baseline of the project these three things are scope statement work breakdown structure and work breakdown structure dictionary three things that comprises the scope baseline of the project are scope statement work breakdown structure and work breakdown structure dictionary 